Mark McKenzie, president of the New Hampshire AFL CIO. Karen Knowles. Hi. And I'm Randy Weingarten, president of the American Federation of Teachers. Where we're at as a family is we are like many other Americans right now. Um, in a uh, position that we didn't think we would be in 10 years ago, and uh, uh, the cost of everything rising right. and uh, not being able to keep up right. with costs, and the, the fact that we need to keep funding schools. We need to keep, we do need to keep funding these things, or else the the, uh, the whole basis of America right. is, is up against the wall if we don't um, fund the uh, programs that, that need to be funded. I mean, it's, it's amazing that when Clinton left office, um, poverty was down, income was up, and we were safe in the world. And what you see now is like a total reverse. But, you know, then you have Sarah Palin winking with people and saying, gotcha, gotcha. Yeah. <laughs> I'm a soccer mom. And you're right, it's scary. because then, But that's why the yeah, right. say, oh, we're walking around today really trying to answer people's questions. And yeah. how do you speak to them? Yeah, it's pretty funny the other night at the debate, the, we'll give everyone $5,000. Well, right. $5,000 gets you five months of a family plan right. and health care. And tax it. And it gets taxed on the other, exactly. on the business end, and therefore the businesses say, well, guess what? We can't afford to fund as much as we used to fund. Exactly right. The difference between their campaign as well is they have, are removed from everyday life. Right. They need to walk into a school in Nashua, walk into a school in Concord, and see what is happening 